morning, the YouTubes, the peoples, the worlds. What do I have this out for? Um, anyway, welcome back to the channel. Half fast, 719. Oh, I have this out because a little car out there, a black car, didn't want to start last night. <clears throat> um, so basically what we were doing is we were programming the garage door. So my garage door for the home link worked on the Audi. Well, I'm a dummy and I reset it because I was trying to set the, the gates out there those gates to the home link and reset the garage and uh, because these garage is a rolling code home links and everything are weird um, but anyway rolling codes are different so when you program these with regular remotes you basically push the button hold it down for 20 seconds and then after the 20 seconds is up it'll flash and you come out here with the remote and you point it right here you hold the remote down the lights whatever blinkers whatever mirror blinkers will blink and then you push the button for two seconds and then it's programmed but with the rolling code <coughs> you gotta push this you got 30 seconds to go in there to hold that down for 20 seconds and when you hold that down for 20 seconds then you can push it and then it'll flash then you do the two seconds, and then the two seconds, and two seconds, and then it worked. Anyway, that's how the Audi worked. And then, uh, yeah, so while we were messing with that, the battery died. So I think the battery's been going out for a while, because when I left to come home, uh, the last, whatever, on Tuesday, I should get some sunglasses. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, anyway, when I left Tuesday, um, I got in the car and went to start the car. And it went. Oh, I got the keys. Oh, it's unlocked. And it went. Um, and then started. Um, and I think it was because it was warm. And I think mainly because when I'm at work, I get to work early. And I sit there. I sit there and uh, listen to the radio and do whatever else. And, uh, yeah. So, I think the battery needs replaced. Um, I'll do a video on that. It's kind of a pain in the butt. Uh, it's under the driver's seat. <clears throat> you gotta undo some bolts, some, some clips, some stuff. And then tilt the seat back. And do some other hokey pokey crap. Um... Um, but yeah, so, <clears throat> I gotta go, I get my batteries from Pet Boys, um, because Pet Boys, chocolate, uh, Pet Boys has the best deals on the batteries, I like Bosch, I like running Bosch batteries, and, uh, sorry, I'm digging for receipts, I like Bosch batteries because they have a four year warranty, <clears throat> No questions asked warranty. And I get them from Pet Boys because um, Pet Boys is kind of everywhere, I guess you can say. And uh, I don't know. I just like, I've always ran Bosch batteries um, in all my cars, especially the cars I travel with. So the wife's car's got Bosch batteries. <clears throat> my old uh, fourth gen has Bosch batteries. Uh, my old Acura has Bosch battery, and now the Audi will have a Bosch battery. So, and uh, speaking of batteries, I'm gonna be all over the place today, guys. So, so bear with me here. I got stuff to do. I got 17 hours worth of stuff to do, and I gotta do it in two hours. You know how it is. Life of me. So. For those of you guys that don't know about my gate, I'm gonna try to make this a 10 minute video. 10 minutes, 10 minutes, see if I can do it, 10 minutes. So these batteries that are out here on the gate, the gate openers, those are from my toy hauler. 
<clears throat> so I figured out my gate. Gate opener thing works awesome. Everything lines up. I figured out how to do the stupid settings. So now the gate closes. I opened it and closed it 50, 60 times yesterday. And it's great. <clears throat> These things are awesome now. So money, well, well worth it. Especially for 100 bucks a piece, 200 bucks for $800 worth of stuff. <clears throat> so I got another solar panel. Went to Harbor Freight, bought two more solar panel things. So I'm going to keep these two batteries out here. I'm going to build boxes. I was going to go buy boxes this morning. I was going to buy boxes, 4x4, four four, uh, concrete, and some conduit, some other crap. So anyway, one in Glen, free money, Saturday. So what I'm going to do with the bunch of wood I got in the barn, is I'm going to build a box with a little stand that comes off the side of the box that holds this. This is your antenna. Holds that up here in the air and put the solar panel kind of at an angle. Probably like a, I don't know, that type of angle. So that this way rain gets on it, it'll wash off. And because the sun comes right here, comes across, basically follows these power lines. And then during the winter, it goes over there. So this way I'll get full sun exposure to charge these batteries. <clears throat> and then I'm gonna make two boxes, identical. I figure I'll do wood boxes because the wood boxes, the wood will retain the heat. Whereas a lot of people use a uh, Tupperware or uh, big bin boxes. And uh, I think those are too hot. So anyway, these batteries off my toy hauler. That battery, it's in the Audi. I'm gonna take that battery because it's like seven feet long. <clears throat> I think it's a, uh, I can't remember. It's like 15, 16 inches long in the Audi. I'm gonna take that battery because it's a marine grade style sealed battery and I'm gonna put that on the toy hauler go get a new battery for the Audi. And this way I know the battery's done, battery's good. Um, cause that's probably the original battery. Um, and take a solar panel, take a solar panel thingy and put it on this battery on the toy hauler. So as you can see, I got another solar panel. This is the one, the other one I put on last night. <clears throat> so we went, oh nice, I got two minutes. Nice, that works. Anyway, um, we went yesterday, had to get a quote done on the Audi because uh, Audi dealership up there in Portland, they didn't do what they were supposed to do. And I'm uh, missing parts, missing hardware under the car. And uh, they cut the felt. So this, this wheel well lining is all cut down here. It's supposed to wrap around and down there, but they just took a razor knife and cut it, which is why it's hanging right here. Um, but anyway, so they get, they're going to give me a quote for that. Some clips, the little door that's under here. <clears throat> Let's see if I can see it. A oh, little door, that little opening. It's supposed to have a little access door that's missing the lady at Audi said well we put it on and I said well the old one was on there for you know 70 80,000 miles never had a problem with it falling off and she said well technicians technician said it was on there and uh, I looked at the parts they ordered they never even ordered it it's not even in their list um, so anyway they got to give me a quote on that and a couple scratches that are on the bottom of the car, uh, on the bottom side of the car that weren't there. <clears throat> so, yeah. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna build some boxes. I'll probably do a video of those boxes, battery boxes and solar panel boxes. Um, I'll do a video of the battery for the Audi because that's the other thing is they will only wanna give you $18 for the battery. I think that battery probably is still good um actually let's start the car and see what it does <clears throat> i 
I think this battery is still good. I just think it's a little weak, honestly. We'll see. We'll see what it does. It's almost like I don't want to change it though. But I'd rather change it now when I can rather than having to be somewhere where I can't change it if you guys catch my drift. So then, and where I'm working is a bunch of podunk little towns that are out in the middle of nowhere. So this battery, if I have to replace it, is probably going to cost me 300 bucks or more. Um, I have AAA. AAA can come out and jumpstart me and they could sell me a battery, but I'm sure it's premium and it's probably not even that good of a battery. It's probably a Walmart brand battery. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, so uh, yeah, so stay tuned for those videos, guys. Bear with me. I'm all over the place. I got too much crap to do, too much stuff to do, and not definitely not enough time to do it. Um, and it's getting hot. It's that's one thing about California where I'm at is it's cold and it's hot. And if you're not out here from 7 or 6 to 10 o'clock, then it's either cold or it's hot. And uh, yeah, and right now it is getting hot. I think it was 91 degrees yesterday. It was pretty hot. <clears throat> so anyway, look forward to those videos, guys. Be on 10 minutes. Got to go. Thank you guys for watching. Subscribe if you haven't. Do what you guys do. Thank you guys for, for being part of the my uh, experiences, my lives, but I guess later.